This morning, I was accosted by three men carrying some poor soul's head atop a pike. Seems they mistook my uniform for a mark of nobility and demanded I shout, long live the Republic, to prove my allegiance. I suppose handing out tricolor cockades is now passé. What did you do? I shouted, long live the Republic. A man of principle. Life is more valuable than dignity. But this is what happens when you give command of the government to half-starved lunatics and command of the army to bloodthirsty savages. Rui. I wanted him assigned to some out-of-the-way garrison, but the man redefines the term friends in high places. He's untouchable. But you know where I can find him. Rumor about the barracks is that he and a unit of his cronies plan on marching on the Grand Châtelet this afternoon. If he were to meet with an accident, few in France would suffer. My career certainly wouldn't. Well, practice your speech making. Nobody try anything. Come on, boys! Find me a warden! Behind him. Keep still. Hey, I was right Keep behind the bastard. Bastards. He's just bloody scoped off, hasn't he? Hands where I can see him. Monsters! <laughs> Sons of bitches! <laughs> Silence! You'll go to the guillotine for this. Don't make this harder on yourselves. Don't move! Merci, monsieur. 
I don't know what unit you serve with, but thank you. You can thank me by getting to the walls and stopping these killings. We oui, must They weren't fed on bread and water. Ick. Now, oh, well, got better things to do. Protect the prisoners! Death to the traitors! Beat them back! Vive la révolution! Steady! Into the breach! Hold that line! Kill them all! You're a friend to me, brother. No need for any ugliness. It's easy to abuse the poor and bully the weak.
since last you saw him. since last you saw him. <laughs> oh, are you so kin, Gordon? Well, I'm terribly sorry, Warden. Only, well, we couldn't find the rest of him. <laughs> well, if you don't want it, I suppose... I suppose it would make a fine souvenir. Allons upon de la patrie, le jour de toi et ta vie. Come on, sing, sing! Come now, warden. Let's have a cheer. Vive la révolution! What's the matter? Not a fan of liberty. Freedom bores you. Ah, look, he misses you. <laughs> tut, tut, warden. Your brother will think you rude. Mine. He's lost a bit of weight since last you saw him. Warden. Sacrifice you, faggot!
If you have orders to remove us from this hall, you must also get authority to use force. For we shall yield to nothing but bayonets! <laughs> Minister is to govern. To govern is to reign. That is the essence of the problem. Mr. Mirabeau. Pathetic, isn't it? Surely France deserves better. What was that? Roy, clean up your mess, it's tight. Told you I could make him talk. You've done well, Captain. Breathe. The price of grain is higher than ever, Grandmaster. Our agents are in place to divert the shipments to our docks. They await only your command. Ooh. Starve them. Through famine and fury, they will see their false masters for what they are, but do it gradually. But you're asking will take at least a year, Grandmaster. If not two, 